manufacturing industry is ready to play a vital role in Europe's economic recovery, but the European Union must put the right conditions in place. That was the message from industry leaders to EU policymakers at a special event at the European Parliament. For Orgelim and CMET, it was the opportunity to deliver their joint manifesto, manufacturing a stronger and greener Europe, right to the very top. It's their response to the European Commission's own communication, setting out a strategy to boost industrial output to 20% of GDP. To help manufacturing industry achieve that, the manifesto calls for improvements in 11 key areas, from regulation and financing to labour market reforms and energy. And they secured this pledge from the European Commission President. European manufacturing is an essential sector for our future prosperity, but indeed it faces many challenges. Let me assure you that you can count on my personal commitment to make sure that creating the right conditions for industry remains at the core of the European agenda. And let me confirm that the European Commission will help the sector meet these challenges. The key role of manufacturing in growing and greening Europe's economy was echoed by another senior European Commission figure. Industry is at the centre of this new growth model. There is no sustainable growth without competitive and innovative industries, and there is no innovation without industrial investment to adopt new technologies and to manufacture new products. Orgelim President Richard Dick says the Commission itself and national governments could do more to help unlock the potential of technologies already available. We talk about smart grids and smart meters um, and, uh, and improving buildings and saving energy. We've actually invented all those technologies. They exist. What we need to do is to apply them. And that's where our friends in the Commission and our governments can help us uh, in order to do that, to set, to set the scene. Regulation, too, is an area where some see real room for improvement from the Commission. Now, I recognize and we all recognize that regulation is important, but as we and you regulate, our competitor nations and the emerging economies are not regulating to the same extent and we are losing ground to them. MEP Malcolm Harbour says legislators must understand the dynamics of manufacturing. When we're asking them to commit to legislation, say to deal with climate change, to deal with product safety, that needs to be done at the same pace of their business so that they can introduce the changes and they can bring in and invest in those new products. With growing markets for European manufacturers beyond the EU's borders, there were also calls for free trade agreements to be a political priority. Open markets are the oxygen for us as a highly competitive industry. We need them to survive and at the end of the day Free trade is indispensable to secure and to create jobs in Europe. It's now hoped the Orgelim and CMET manifesto will make a real impact on decision makers at a European and national level and pave the way for manufacturing to help deliver a stronger, greener Europe. This video was produced for Orgelim, the European Engineering Industries Association.